she's going to cook a fantastic Nepalese curry. Or not really a curry, but more of a Nepalese dish, chicken dish. There's the chicken. There we have coriander, fresh. Red chopped onions and chilli. Cut down the middle. Some chopped tomatoes, fresh. What's that? Garlic. Garlic and ginger paste made by hand herself and half a lemon. A little up on you and me. Hold on. I want you stay a while. You know it's doing anything in the world that be now. Honestly, turning the cup up, it's this. Is that the noise? Yeah. yeah. fluffy like any good Asian restaurant would make. Well, not any res Asian restaurant, not like Chinese rice, it's basmati rice we use. She uses I can't cook rice. Useless. It turns into slop or very either very hard or very sloppy. With a wooden spoon. She's getting that going. It's the seeds. Frying away already in that just to yeah, give the oil a bit of flavour. It needs to go a bit dark, like black, otherwise it will taste bitter. Oh, okay. So make sure that it is dark, yeah. black. Yeah. Otherwise, you don't want to taste it because it will bit bitter. No. Okay. I'm going to make the one that you really like. Yeah, I like a dark, I call it the dark one. I like it dark, I like it fried, I like the crispy, I like the chicken to be quite crispy. So you're putting half a teaspoon of... Turmeric powder. Turmeric. Uh, it works for like an antidote as well, turmeric powder. Okay, an antidote to what? Uh, to uh, loads of... To like a Marvel movie? No. What is it? It's an antidote for many diseases and things like that. Okay, so at the moment, very good. There goes the chicken, the chicken's going there. And we'll get fried around in the like, like, so. I'm all the head of every time that we meet. I wish you didn't get hung up so easily. I like the t-shirt though. Is that your cooking top? Yeah, it's my only cooking top. Is that your favourite artist? Indeed. Good. I'm just Good. Saying. Right answer. Yes. Let's do this is right answer. <laughs> Sorry, we're into extras at the moment. We're giving extras another watch. Fantastic show. Smarties! Yum, 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 yum! <laughs> <laughs> you could ever have started saying that. Yeah, we don't want him saying that, do we? <laughs> no, it's okay. Is it? Bunny. Yeah. I like Bunny. I'm sure you do. I think George Michael was fantastic in that. Yeah, he was. Wasn't Such a sport. Like, Les Dennis was good as well. Oh, the Les Dennis one is possibly my favourite one, actually. I like that one a lot. 
the chicken is going brown and um, but we need a bit more brown. Okay, and it's, oh, but obviously it's not cooked in the middle yet. And plus, I like it. I like it fried to the death. I like it crispy. Always fall apart at the sea. I'm so warm, I'm so torn, time to sign like an old man. The chicken needs to be brown like that. Chicken needs to be brown like that. Yeah, yeah that's, so what we that do. tasty already. Yeah, so what we need to do is we need to put a little bit of lemon. Yeah. Need some lemon juice in there, yeah. Okay. Not a lot, like one spoon. Yeah. To do, and then a bit of salt. Yeah. People, you know, some people like a little bit salty, some people like a little bit, you know. Yeah. Salty, so it's but we use proper sea salt. It's not yeah. just like the crappy sand salt that you get and you know for thirty p. This is proper nice sea salt, and it's not. It's, good for your it's not too bitter, is it? It's like a nice salt. It's like salt on crisps or something. Hold on tight. This flavor. Anyway, so there's now. the salt. That's gold and brown, that's how I like it. I like it like that. I like uh, it like that. A bit of a coriander and cumin powder. Coriander and cumin coriander and I cumin powder. powder, okay. Yeah, my mom said oh. it's really done now. Really done now, but we have another box. Okay, so that goes in there now. Yeah. And the chicken is done. Yeah, you need to like share properly. But make yeah. sure the chicken is not like gone mushy or anything like that. Yeah. The main seal. Yeah, and, and now. And cook through to the middle now. One chili. One whole chili goes in that, there. So it's never like hot. Yeah, no. It's it's got a little bit of a kick it's to it. it but it's not, but it's not, it's not um, stupidly hot because you don't use any chili powder. Just proper fresh chilies. Yeah, and onion. Now, red onions go in there. Yeah. Uh, yeah, try to cook uh, curry with red onions because the taste is a lot better. Yeah. But I like it that way. I like it that way. This is my favourite dish, everybody. You can cook along. You can show your face. I can't show my face. What? Here's my face. Yeah, our kitchen is, when, when Rena cooks, she does tidy up after us. When I cook, I leave it sprawled out all over the kitchen and it's a mess and it smells. And, it makes me angry. And it makes her angry and then that's, that's me in the doghouse for another week. Another week in the doghouse. That's not true, is it? No. I get away with quite a few things. Again, onion is now cooked. Yeah, the onions are done now. That doesn't take long for the onions, does it? No, it doesn't. So now, now there's the tomatoes. Fresh chopped tomatoes. Fresh chopped tomatoes. Fresh chopped tomatoes. Wow. And what kind of tomatoes are they? Cherry? Uh, either baby tomato or cherry tomato. Any of the tomatoes. Any yeah. little tomatoes. As long as they're little and tasty. Yes. Yeah. If you don't like the big, big beef tomatoes. Well, people, like... can, people can use that as well. But we... Okay, so next. We need to put some ginger and garlic paste. Ginger and garlic paste, freshly done. Yeah. Beaten in a pestle and mortar, which is over here. That was a present from me, probably a uh, probably a wedding present from me. Um, I spoil her, I really do. There goes the garlic and ginger paste that she made. Fantastic. Uh, now that smells so delicious now. You have no idea. We let it simmer and cook a little bit more. Yeah, we let it simmer and cook. So, for now, we put a little bit of coriander for now. A little bit of coriander for now, just to add a bit of colour and a bit of flavour. And later on, we'll top it off with more of that. Some people 
really? Who doesn't like Corrie? <laughs> So this is me at my house, obviously Andy Bennett, musician full time, uh, usually play music anyway. Been doing a, a gig a week so far, probably have to stop that now, otherwise people are gonna get bored. Um, so we're just showing you a few things that we kind of tend to do day to day things. And uh, we, um, we did a cooking video earlier of um, showing me making breakfast. Uh, which we'll probably put up on, on Facebook soon. But uh, um, right now we've uh, filmed my wife, Rina, making a fantastic dish, a Nepalese curry dish. And she's finished, um, we filmed it all, the preparation of it all and, uh, and cooking it all. We didn't film the prep, we filmed the cooking of it and showed you all the ingredients that went in it. Here she is, here's, here's my wife, Rina, and here is the dish that she made. Fantastic, and I'm gonna go and enjoy that right now. Check it out.